Sorry, James. Hold the associate. Man, my boy sent me this, bro. We're going to have to see what's going on, man. Everybody talking about Bronny went crazy at the combine. He went some crazy number, they said. 16 for 24, shooting the three. I said in what? A drill? Man, my boy sent me the drill. And this is no hate on Bronny. Don't get me wrong. I, Me, you come to my channel, I'm just going to keep it up. Honey, I fuck with Bronny. I personally think he should be a gamer. And continue doing that. He'd be one of the biggest streamers in the fucking world. You know how much money Bronny can make? Fuck all this other shit, bro. I, if you're playing for the passion of you, bro, I got it. Or if you're playing under the pressure of your dad, trying to get somewhere that you really want to go because your dad want, that's different. I'm going to be honest, bro. You're a good-ass kid, bro. And I fuck with you. But I really think you should just be a YouTuber, streamer, open a business, nigga that got money. You could really flourish. And I'm not saying that you're already a billionaire. But I'm just saying, bro, like, your stream shit was so hard. Like, you know, you with FaZe and all your gaming shit, to me, was much harder. What I've been seeing out of you, bro, I just don't like the hate that you get. And it's honestly like, bro, if you're not finna prove us wrong, you you were gonna keep getting that same hate, bro. And honestly, bro, when it comes to basketball, I gotta keep it real, bro, because there's a lot of prospects out there. I'm gonna be honest, bro. I don't think Bronny should even be in this draft combine. That's just me. I'm not being a hater. I think he should be back in school trying to develop again. So, another thing. The drill that I saw yesterday, and like I said, I'm not going to keep it uh, one-way street just because of Bronny. They're doing the drills half ass. They're doing the drills literally in half speed. I'm looking at some of these other players. They're doing it in full speed. I'm like, why is Bronny jogging, walking? It's like, bro, you're doing the drill in half speed, my boy. That kind of threw me off. So let's get straight to the scrimmage. This is the draft combine right here. Not right now. And I think most of the guys we're going to watch today is, is probably going to be in the G League for next year. I think he's certainly a developmental project. Uh, and we say he wasn't the lead guard because they had Isaiah Collier and Boogie Ellis, but he was for a six game period of time. They went one in five. He shot 27% from three. Speed, he was bro. a sub five po points per game score over the course of the season. Here we go. And we're playing ball. Uh, this These is are the draft prospects? Where are they going to put Bronny James? They want Andrew him in the point guard. A couple years ago. As far as really had a, a solid two days. They want Bronny at the point guard. He's here and, and why not get... He's not a point guard. Oh my God, that's another thing. Trying to force these kids to be a position or not. Bronny's not a point guard, bro. Another thing, Bronny got listed at 6 1. Drafted uh, in early part of the point guard. There's one thing when it comes to a setting like this, and you all know it well. Don't do what you can't do, do what you do well. It's special. And wind up getting drafted uh, in early part of the point guard. There's one thing when it comes to a setting like this, and you all know it well. Don't do what you can't do. Why are you, you passing that off, Bronny? Why are you passing that off, Bronny? We're in, a, we're in the NBA combine, Bronny. Why aren't you trying to go up there and be aggressive, Bronny? Uh, this is where they're going to put Bronny James. They want him Andrew in the point guard. Years years ago. Ago. As far as really had a, a solid okay, two days here and, and wind up getting drafted. Okay, this is the draft class? Oh, my God. Really the point guard. There's one thing. Well, I know it's just the combine, but this shit, sorry. When it comes to a setting like this, and you all know it well. Bronny, go to the basket. Go try to dunk that. What are we doing? Don't do what you can't do. Do what you do Turn well. Special. And that hurts them, I think, in this process. Yeah, Absolutely. Uncle Chuck once told well, me that. they don't know what you don't know unless you this year. Unless made that. that nigga's trash. Whoever that was, I'm just, like I said, I don't give a fuck about none of that, bro. I'm keeping it G. I don't give a fuck who you are. Whoever this is, number 32. How you get around the screen? Okay. Uncle John was told and then you go with the left hand, wide open layup, and you miss it. I mean, they don't know what you don't know so unless you this year. And I think one of the things that stood out most What's to me was the unselfish. Was garbage. Just in the ball movement that you caught. Bronny, the... what are you doing, bro? Why did it make it seem like this nigga was going to go crazy? So so you you this year. And I think one of the things that stood out most to me was the unselfishness in the again. ball movement that you caught. Ah, he's that guy that knows that he would have to take a long, long route to get there. But Pat, his older brother, actually got a two-way this year with in this draft. Let me ask you this, Bobby, from a, from an executive perspective. Like, when there's such limited oh, the, film, yeah. there's not. I was a star my entire life. In my first game in San Antonio, I never took my warm-up off. LeBron James Jr. LeBron James Sr. and the Lakers have a few things. 24 NBA draft combine. A lot of guys out here working 
in the scrimmage. I was doing everything, and, and with all the great guys that are here, the great players, and then, you know, it's totally everything, great. you know, um, you know, just continuing to stay in the also gym, stay in John shape. Calipari come through. Now with Mark Pope coming back to Kentucky, are you going to be that bridge that brings the old with the new? Because you're going to have that separation of <laughs> Cal guys, and now the old guys coming back in with Mark Pope. My time with Kentucky. I'm sorry, bro. Brody needs to go back to school or go be a streamer. You're not a point guard. You have no dribble. You're not seeing the floor very well. You got really no handle package. You got no confidence. You look small. You're not fast. I'm not trying to be a hater, bro. You're not proving to me nothing. You had three turnovers since I watched. You ain't fucking scored. You don't even have an assist. And you, these niggas out here look like they fucking in high school. Perry I can't believe this now, but Mark Pope class, coming bro. back to Kentucky. I'm Are you going to be that bridge that brings the old with the new? Because you're going to have that separation of <laughs> Cal guys, and now the old guys Turn coming up. back in with Mark My time with Kentucky was unbelievable. Uh, you know, having the it, opportunity is crazy, and it's really, really cool. Well, so it's like, it's like we'll you. We'll see you around. Keep throwing that stash out. Yep. <laughs> swing. All right, let's get back to so some game action. Guard, pick and roll. You know, one of the things with Reed Shepard, who just joined us, one more turnover, nigga, and I'm turning this shit off, bro. And don't call me about fucking Bronny, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> bro, like I said, I'm not trying to be like that person, bro, but what the fuck? All right, let's get this back. is the Lakers pick that they want. Nigga, hell no. I'm a Laker. Hell no. Get rid of both then, bro. So <laughs> better not be on guard pick and roll. See, one of the things with Breed Shepard who just. What is that? Joined us. Back this uh, game, it just really stands out how all the four turnovers. Players on the floor are older guys. You know, late with his reads. The playmaking isn't there. You know they're playing a little bit of point he guard, and he's not comfortable. He needs to go back to college. Thank you. Thank you. He needs to find a college that is going to put the ball in his hands. Thank you. He isn't there. You know they're playing a little bit of point. Say how it all again. The best players on the floor are older guys. You know, late with his. Say it again. Say it again. Reads. The playmaking isn't there. You know they're playing a little bit the of point guard, and he's not there. comfortable. He needs to go back to college. Thank you. How all the best players on the floor are older guys. Late with his reads. The playmaking isn't there. Late with his reads. The playmaking isn't there. He needs to go back to college. Again. You know, they're playing a little bit of point guard and he's not comfortable. He needs to go back to college. And he needs to find a college that is going to put the ball in his hands. You can absolutely play that position at that size. You look at Deuce McBride for the New York Knicks, who took Southern California, does a great job with the team. Why not? There's so many of these in club circuit. Whether another turnover, I like how they try to skip that one. I like how they try to skip that one right there. Another there's turnover. So many of these in club circuit. Whether it's there, whether it's the Adidas gauntlet, or whether it's the <laughs> like, nigga, you just look so like I'm so it. This is this is why I don't like to do this shit. This is why I don't like to react to Brian because I don't want to be honest. You need to take your ass back to school. In club circuit, whether it's there. You're too passive, bro. There's nobody on the court. These are a bunch of nobodies out here. These ain't nobodies. Nigga, I ain't seen you score once. I ain't even seen you trying to attempt. Nigga, I need to go put some lotion on, bro. Whether it's the Adidas gauntlet. Ooh, or whether like, it's nigga, that pass looks shitty. Pro, the pro 16. <laughs> nigga, there's no crisp. The way the system is structured right now, these kids do get to play against. Oh, this nigga, bro. <laughs> This nigga threw that bitch in the air. The way the system is structured right now, these kids do get to play against some of the oh, best yeah. in the country. Nigga, some don't rewind that, nigga. Even the world yeah, that's but all those stunts up to an extent because they all become... Nigga look like the smallest nigga out there. Friends. Yeah, they don't often compete Older against guys. their friends. It's like, nigga, you getting... Niggas is blowing by you and they not even like that, fool. Extent right because up. they all become friends. Yeah, they don't often compete against their friends. They're so old because they had the COVID year. They've been in, in uh, you know, their circuit. college. 32. Who is that? One or two years of college, maybe, if they've been in the G League. Stop it, Brian. There's going to be a pro, <laughs> and there will be somebody out here that becomes that. But what I have seen, Stop it, he's he has year. officially said it, but I think he is very committed to this process. Right. And a lottery pick? No. Necessarily a 
future all-star? Probably not. I mean, but listen, it's going to be important for him to show better than that. I'm sure how adaptable listen. he is to whatever schemes they have out there, what type of person he is within that locker room. Because the reality is he's going and there's something is not an NBA player. They all tripping, fool. One of an unrealistic expectation. But how Bronny managed that to me was super impressive. Well, he's not right. um, I'm sorry. You know, I think as a role player, is there one or two things you can do really well, right? If you do five terrible. or six things Only really hard. well, you might be at the next level, or, and what I think they'd hoped it was gonna be at USC last year. Wrote about it, and he said, it is not a priority. And workouts yeah. and a chance to sit and visit with him. Push, um, is there push, an organization push, that has a down plan the court. that has, you know, a Make it, get the fuck out of here, bruh. Get the fuck out of here, bruh. Nah, bro, I'm done, bro. Bronny. And visit with him. Push. You got a wide open man um, running the floor. Is there an organization? Nigga, get the fuck. You putting it up. And that has a plan that Kinda. has. This nigga's pissing me off. Okay. You know, a you know, LeBron wants Bronny to be his off. own you better man. better not drop that nigga. I'm not playing with you. No. Good play. I'll tell you what, pass. He showed some versatility. He was a transfer from Missouri State. Influence that we see with some of the top prospects here. And the European influence with that behind the back pass. You've been watching a lot of Joker like running down the lane. <laughs> that there's something here, but he wasn't playing. That's uh, a travel, at fool. <laughs> I, mean, I ain't gonna lie. I thought Bronny had handles. Bronny ain't got no handles like that. That there's Who the fuck said Bronny is a something player? here, but he Look wasn't playing uh, is at a, a level, travel. and then all of a sudden he started to. But he wasn't. I'm not trying to be like that, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Playing uh, at a level, and then all of a sudden he started to go to some regional Quite tournaments and get. There's such is it not anything that. Not a glorified <laughs> of the game. A nice drive, shifted the weight of the defensive player, and then looked to attack that seam. Off touch in the middle of the lane. And, you know, we talked about the size of 6'1 one and a half. One of the things that differential you have to actually allows him to. Oh my gosh. One of the things that differential you have to actually allows him. I, I told you, he's just throwing shit up. You have to actually allows him what to is get that? that shot off actually allows him defensively to continue Still to fast. impact the you game. Know, I didn't really get to see him, you know, him play like that, but you know, you hear all the all, all the noise and things like that. So the origin I mean, of Wheeler great. High this School. This nigga didn't shot two for twenty. Mm -hmm. And right. y'all hyping him up. Some stars have come out of yeah. Wheeler. Yeah. Yeah. When you were in New Jersey, Brooklyn, you're not asking him to come okay. play that role. You're asking all him right. to I'm sorry. Honestly, bro, speaking, I'm gonna be honest, bro. Between me and y'all, whoever watched this video, if you think Bronny's ready for the NBA, you're drunk. You're drunk. Stop lying to yourself. If the nigga's last name wasn't James, you wouldn't give a fuck. He wouldn't even be where he's at now. He wouldn't have even been at USC. Stop lying to yourself. I'm just keeping it 100 because it's disrespectful how Bronny is the number one thing talked about Coming out of college, when we got plenty of players, plenty, plenty of players, better than Bronny, straight up, bro. I'm out of here, bro. I gotta keep it a thousand with you. You know, stop lying to yourself. Nine to eighty-one. Hopefully, we have a player over the game. Very. Want to make Earth happy? Nigga got more minutes. Y'all talk about minutes. Nigga got more minutes. Did the same fucking thing. I'm out of here.